Hi, in today's video we'll be showing you how to access Napster from anywhere in the world using a VPN. Now, if you were born in the mid 80s or uh, early 80s, you definitely know what Napster is. Now, Napster used to, it started off as a P2P sharing uh, program or service just for music. It was the first one to do such or to, um, to do such a service or to uh, create such a service, uh, the P2P sharing world. Uh, later on, a lot of other companies followed uh, in the same direction, LimeWire uh, and many other uh, applications. Now, Napster uh, was started operating in 1999 and operated for two years and it was shut down in 2001 uh, under uh, legal complications uh, uh, in the sense of infringement of copyrights. After many years passed, uh, it was uh, it was bought by another company, and um, it was bought by another company and turned it, which turned it into an online music store. Now it turned it into an online music store with the same popular name, and this is why it became an extremely popular online music store. Now. Sadly, Napster uh, is not available except from a, a list of very few countries around the world. Um, and this is why if you're outside of these countries, you won't be able to access it except by using a VPN. Now, a VPN or virtual private network is a service that allows its users to connect to uh, a list, any, any one of a list of servers located all over the world for different persons purposes but the purpose that we want here is to connect to a server that's located within one of the countries that are uh, that Napster is accessible from in this case once a connection is established in that country the site will be tricked into thinking that you are actually in that country and will grant you access now the VPN provider that we'll be using today is BVPN BVPN started off in 2014. Um, uh, they're, they're one of the most uh, popular uh, VPNs available in the market, one of the most secure and reliable VPNs available in the market today. They're based in the Netherlands. Um, in a very short time, in a matter of three years or less, uh, they became they grew to become one of the biggest names actually in the VPN industry. Now, of course, you can use any of any other uh, VPN provider that you prefer. However, the most important thing is that they have to have a server located in one of these countries and we'll be showing you the list in uh, in a bit. Uh, moving on from there, let's, uh, now this is when we open the Napster site, this is what we first get the main page here. Now if we try to access anything on it, let's try Napster for free, for example, the free trial and click on that. Now this is the error that comes up. The plan you have selected is not available in your country. If you are in a supported country and believe you are all that fuss. So it means that it's unaccessible. Now here is the list of supported companies, Argentina, Brazil, Chile, uh, Costa Rica, Ecuador, Finland, Germany, uh, Guatemala, Italy, Mexico, uh, Nicaragua, Panama, Portugal, Sweden, United Kingdom, Uruguay, Austria, Canada, Colombia, Denmark, El Salvador, France, Greece, Ireland, Luxembourg, Netherlands, Norway, Peru, Spain, Switzerland, United States. So let's pick, so what we need to do is when we open the VPN, we need to connect to a server that's located within one of these countries. Now let's open BVPN and give it a try. Now here is how the interface looks like of BVPN. Now we're gonna choose a choose from the list which server we want to connect to. Now it said one of these countries is Germany, so we're just going to give it a try to connect to a server in Germany and see if we're able to access Napster. So 
now connected we're just gonna minimize it and close it and reopen Napster US okay now let's try Napster free so it brought us to the German Napster but this is not what we want I'm unable to read German, so I'm just going to try to close it and connect to a server within an English-speaking country such as the UK or the US. Let's try the UK, for example. So I'm going to close it and I'm going to connect to uh, let's see, you disconnect and connect to the UK. Let's see. Okay, UK London and connect. Okay, so we're connected to UK London. Let's try to access Napster. Napster.com and try Napster free. Okay, sorry, this plan is currently not available in your country. So the UK didn't work. Let's try to go to homepage United Kingdom. So we were able to access Napster United Kingdom. Okay, but we weren't able to access Napster US. Okay, and start your free trial and a lot of things of what they offer. Okay, so let's try to close it and access Napster US. Okay, so all we need to do is disconnect and choose to connect to a server within the US. So let's try US New Jersey and connect. Okay, we're connected now. Let's try to open Napster US or so us.napster.com and try Napster free. And we are in. All you need to do is sign up and you're good to go. And you get a 30 day, by the way, you get a 30 day free trial once you sign up. But we're not going to sign up at the moment. Um, you enter an email, you choose the password, after that, the step after that is um, uh, choosing your payment method, it's $9.99 uh, a month, uh, you choose your payment method and uh, you get a free uh, month uh, trial. Uh, once that free month is over, if you don't ask to cancel it, automatically $9.99 will be taken out of your account or uh, through the payment method that you chose and this is how you access Napster from anywhere in the world you can access Napster UK you can access Napster Germany you can access Napster US depending on the server that you connect to that's where you'll be uh, accessing Napster uh, and that's how you access Napster from anywhere in the world using a VPN well thank you for watching